Hey family, it's sorta. Like this avocado tree right here. It takes an avocado tree, an average of about three to five years to bear fruit. But after it begins to bear fruit, it will continue to live for about 200 to 400 years. So for the next two to 400 years, that avocado will continue to bear fruit. So it is with your self family. Once you embark on that path of personal development, self-development, it's gonna take about an average of three to five years for you to start seeing some, um, some measurable progress. You just gotta be patient and continue to make measurable progress in reasonable time. Don't lose sight of the path. This is the type of knowledge and understanding that grants me patience with everything that I'm working on right now. From my body, to the intellectual properties that I continue to create, you get what I'm saying? To my own spiritual development and everything else in life. It takes the average human 30 to 40, sometimes 50 plus years for them to produce a something that continues to feed not only him in this lifetime, but many generations long after his or her passing. Just look at Colonel, Colonel whatever the heck that came off with the uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken. He started that at 70 plus years old. So it is with us, man. That's why we need patience. The goal is always measurable progress and reasonable time. Measurable progress and reasonable time. To continue to work on yourself consistently, continuously, persistently, without ceasing, in every way, shape, and form that it is necessary. From your faith, your belief in yourself, your fitness, to your relationship with your families, with your friends, with your finances, with coming up with new visions, with uh, other things that you are good at or that you can improve at in, or that you see yourself having a predisposition towards that you can develop and that you can capitalize on. Only by so doing will you continue to ensure that you do manifest for yourself your desire, life and lifestyle. One that is filled with health, wealth, prosperity and joy always keep in mind family that nothing comes by wishy-washy ain't no manifestation without the fucking work all right so do your due diligence be proactive about you know your daily readings your daily journaling listening to the right people following the right people the right content on these social platforms on these mediums listen to the right mediums you get what i'm saying don't go looking for uh fortunes when you have the fortunes right in front of you give thanks practice daily gratitude you get what i'm saying gratitude molds our attitude our attitude is reflected in our personality and it's our personality which creates our own personal reality so do the daily readings listening to the right people listening to the right kind of content listening to the books if you're too lazy to read them but be proactive about the process to your success and it is only a matter of time. So be patient. Do what you can with what you got. In the meantime, there is no manifestation without application. Actions speak louder than words. Show up for yourself. Don't show off. Show up for yourself. We cannot lie to the universe. We cannot, we might be able to fool others, but we cannot fool reality. We cannot fool life existence records everything it keeps a receipt for everything that we do be it bad or good so do your best nothing less and when possible as often as you can do a little bit more than your best when working for yourself and especially also when working for others so that you never shortchange yourself take what is useful discard what is not add what is uniquely your own do not depend on your own limited understanding and in all things have faith and trust that things will work out if you